Welcome everybody, this is your boy Gerardo Matsuro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more gaming content and we're going to get straight into the video. But before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters that's on my screen. A big shout out to Sam Meyer aka WLAG, Boss V 31 Foxy, Weez G in Z Gaming and even Brian Arnold. Now these people are our channel members on our YouTube platform and I would like to give a big shout out and thank you for their support. So with that all said, let's get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, this video is all about on how to install the advanced action mod inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. So make sure you download and install all of the latest requirements that's inside my description below. Once you have completed that process then download this mod and I will leave this mod inside my description below as well. So make sure you download the mod. Once you have completed that process then go to your Grand Theft Auto V game hover over it right click and open file location now as you can see i have already installed my requirements so make sure you you do install your requirements too go straight up top the key and then go to your scripts folder and open up your scripts folder now make sure you do install the latest native ui version 1.9.1 and now make sure you do install it inside your scripts folder. Open up your advanced action extract folder and then go inside your extract folder and open up the advanced action folder. Now all you gotta do is select all the files that's inside the folder and drag it inside your scripts folder. Exit out of your extract folder, go back to your main Grand Theft Auto V folder right click refresh your game folder exit out of your game folder right click refresh your desktop and then i'll see you guys in the game and we are back as trevor so we are here in the game and our game did not crash so before we do anything go to your phone and open up your contacts then go right down to the bottom and now go to advanced actions now you'll be calling your menu once the menu pops up, just go to options. Now you can choose either vehicle or player, but I'm gonna do player. So go to player actions, and then go to play actions again. And now these are a few uh, options that you got now. The option that most people that has been searching for, okay, is the gangster aim. That's the one that everybody wants. So if you do want the gangster aim, okay, then make sure you turn that to true. Now the advanced pistol switch, if you want a really gangster uh, like pistol switch, then go to true. Now all the rest, you can make it true if you want to. It's totally up to you, but um, yeah, you can make it all true if you want to. But uh, I'm just going to leave it as the gangster aim and even the advanced pistol switch. So. Once you have done that, you can go to your vehicle and now you can change the vehicle camera if you want to, but I don't really deal with vehicle camera, so I'm going to leave everything as default. Um, faster cars, you can change the faster cars. Um, you can make it all true, okay. Um, cop power lights and flashing lights and etc. Uh, you guys can go around, go through all of this in there now play with the menu if you guys want to so once you guys have finished with that then let's go and test this mod to see if it works now let's go and bring up a pistol okay so let's bring a pistol and there it goes see so to actually activate gangster aim okay just to activate it all you got to do is press your owl key and then now you can start shooting like that see and then now you can just do shooting like this if you want to, okay? And we've got some gangsters over here that wants to shoot me. Okay, we've got some gangsters over here. So yeah guys, sorry, I had to beat up all of these guys over here, so yeah. But um, that's how you guys actually install the mod and that's how you use the mod. So I hope you guys do enjoy this mod. 
and we're back again so i hope you guys do enjoy that mod that mod is an awesome mod so like always if you guys do get stuck installing this mod then please let me know in the comments and i'll be more than welcome to help you out on that as well or if you do get stuck installing any other mods then please let me know in the comments and i'll be more than welcome to help you out on that as well so like always if you guys did enjoy this video then smash that like button and subscribe for more gaming content and i'll see you all on my next video thank you for watching peace and i'm out